Welcome to the HEMA-Q WBC Analyzer instructional video, brought to you by Woodley Equipment Company Limited. The HEMA-Q WBC Analyzer uses proving technology to gain accurate results in approximately three minutes. The analyzer can be used either on battery or mains power, making the HEMA-Q WBC flexible as well as reliable. The white blood cell count is determined by hemolyzation of red cells and colour staining of the white cells inside the analyzer. An image is taken from which the HEMA-Q WBC will count the number of white blood cells. For feline samples, EDTA blood or fresh capillary blood can be used. For canine samples, only fresh capillary blood should be used. Do not use any anticoagulant with canine samples as erroneous results may occur. When testing feline samples, EDTA samples should be tested within 24 hours of sampling and should be thoroughly mixed immediately before testing. Press and hold the power button until the symbols on the display are shown. The analyzer performs a self-test and after approximately 10 seconds, the display will show three flashing dashes and the HEMA-Q symbol. If the cuvette arm is in the measurement position, the most recent result will be displayed. To perform a test, the cuvette arm should be in the loading position. Remove a cuvette from the pot without touching the measuring area. Close the pot immediately to prevent contamination of the remaining cuvettes. The cuvettes have an open pot stability of three months. On opening a new pot of cuvettes, there is space on the pot to record the date of opening. Pots contain 40 cuvettes. Fill the cuvette in one continuous process by placing the tip of the cuvette into the blood at a 45 degree angle. Do not refill the cuvette if it is not filled in one continuous process. Wipe off the excess blood from the outside of the cuvette with a clean lint-free tissue. Do not touch the open end of the cuvette. Look for air bubbles in the filled cuvette. If present, discard the cuvette and fill a new one from a new drop of blood. Small bubbles around the edges can be ignored. Place the cuvette into the cuvette holder no longer than 40 seconds after filling. Gently push the cuvette moving arm into the measuring position and the measurement will start automatically. After approximately three minutes, the WBC value is displayed. The result will remain on the display as long as the cuvette moving arm is in the measurement position. Do not re-measure the filled cuvette. Move the cuvette moving arm to the loading position and remove the filled cuvette. Dispose into a sharps container. To switch the analyzer off, hold the power button until the display reads off. If the analyzer is operating on battery power but not being used, it will automatically turn off after 5 minutes or 2 hours if the AC power is being used. Woodley Equipment Company offers scheduled deliveries of Woodley Haematology quality control material. Running the QC regularly checks the performance of the analyzer, the condition of the cuvettes and the user's technique to ensure reliable test results. QC is run in the same way as a sample. Ensure the QC is at room temperature before testing and mixed by at least 10 inversions. Compare the results to the range supplied on the QC. Thank you for watching.